What it do, folks? It's your boy D with SSP, home of the conventional small block. Um, got a couple projects that I'm working on. I'm going to show y'all what I got in the queue. Y'all know me, Mr. Get them in, get them out. Um, I got a couple things coming this year, 2020. I got three G bodies that I'm going to have on the big reels. We're going to do some big wheel racing with those. So we're going to try to catch all the events at the track this year. Um, I got a Regal. It's just Monte Carlo, and I have a Malibu, and those are all gonna be on 24-inch um, wheels. We're gonna get in the big wheel class with those three cars right there. See what we can do. Try to have a little fun with those. Um, let's see what we got right now in the queue. We have a we got a box seven right now. It's got a small block 400 in it. This engine is coming out for a rebuild, so I gotta take it out. See what's going on with it. Not really sure it just came, but I know it's going for a rebuild. So we're going to get it out, tear it down, see what we're working with, and get it um, get it back together. Um, we got another box Chevy right here that I got going on. This one right here is going to have a 388 stroker motor going in this one. It's going to be on 26-inch roaches. show you all what the interior looking like. It's pretty plain. It's clean. Um, it's got the little custom panels did. Down low, it's got the diesel dash, center console. It's got the mesh throughout the whole car in the doors, mesh in the center console. Uh, it's got the leather, sunroof. Let's see what else we got. Um, we got the mesh in the side pillars. The back deck is done. Like I said, this one right here is going to have a... Uh, 388 stroker motor in it. Then I also have right here is a 80 Malibu. I think it's 80 Malibu. The engine is out. I'm actually waiting on a couple parts to come back before I can get this one back together. Um, but I got the engine. It's about 60% 60, 60 complete. Just had to order a, a piston. Had to get a piston for it. Once the piston come in, I go ahead and finish it up. Get it back in the car so we can see what it's doing. Um, let y'all see the interior on it. This car's been put together for a minute. So, seats for the most part is pretty clean. Seats is pretty clean. We're going to update the speakers, get these speakers out, change out the head unit, um, and update the interior 2020. This car right here will have rooms on the two. It's going on 24 inch, 24 inch roaches. 24 inch roaches, I think it is. Um, what else we got right here? We have a, this is the Camaro, this T Top 79 Z28. That we're working on right now it's fully gutted the interior is out like i said motor and trans is out i'm working on the motor now getting it together actually the motor is complete got to uh, pick the trans up had the trans getting built and then we're going to go ahead and drop the powertrain in it then it's going back to going back for uh, paint and body work and we put in 24 inch ruches on the camaro as well so it's gonna be a nice summer, man. We got a couple projects. Everything seems like everything going on roosters. We're gonna have rims on everything. So we got box Chevy here, box Chevy here, Malibu, Camaro, and I also got a '73 Donk that I'm doing. Subvert. It's in the paint shop now, so of course it's not here yet. Um, it's being painted. I think candy root beer or something like that. Yeah, candy root beer. So once they finish with the paint on that, I'm gonna get it over here. And that's what we have this going in, small block 400. We're going to put this in the dome. Um, actually, be putting this engine together today. I got to run and get a couple more parts for it. And we're going to start assembling that one. So, just a quick view of the parts we got. Pro Max heads, Eagle Crank, Eagle Rods. Uh, Fail Pro engine gasket set. That's the only way to seal it if you want to seal it right. King bearings and all, all the rest of the good stuff. I think those are Icon pistons. Yeah, Icon pistons. Uh, like I said, I think we're going to put on the on the Vert Donk. Then we're going to put nitrous on that car. So, not 100% sure, but I'm almost positive we're going to put nitrous on it. Uh, like I said, it will be a daily driven car. It's going to have heat and AC. 
Mm, but like I say, we will put nitrous on. I get a lot of people asking me, can you put nitrous on the stop motor? Can you spray a stop piston? Can you put nit Can you spray it if you have stop head gaskets? I'm going to try to answer all those questions for you. And I'm going to actually build an engine with stop internals, gaskets, pistons, and stuff like that. I'm going to put nitrous on it. And I'm going to show you that if you have a good, safe, conservative tune that you can spray it and the motor will last. Um, I did probably about four or five engines that way and I've never blown one up spraying them with nitrous. So I'm going to show you how you can set one up and you can do yours the same way. Um, that's for a lot of the DIY guys that just like to do stuff yourself. I'm going to show you how you can do that. Um, so yeah, man, that's what we got in the queue. Won't take long. Got a couple parts coming. We'll have this one together. This one should be get back together in about another, I'm going to say, three, four days. Um, this one here next week. That box Chevy there in the front is probably going to be about a week or so. I got to order some parts for that one. Camaro is pretty much done. We should have him back together in a couple of days. Had the motor in it and cranking in a couple of days. So, uh, yeah, man, y'all stay tuned so you can see what we got coming, man. I got a lot of good projects coming. I got a couple of supercharger cars coming. Um, I have a couple of nitrous cars for sure that I got to do. And I think I have a turbo car that's coming. So, um, y'all make sure you stay tuned, man. If you haven't, like, comment, subscribe to the page. And uh, that way you can stay um, up to date on all the videos when I drop them. You'll know when I'm dropping them. And you can see the, you can see it first. So um, we finna go ahead and I'm finna start opening up these boxes, getting all the parts and everything together, so that I can get started on putting this box together. And uh, once I get everything laid out, I get back with y'all. We'll begin to put the short block together, and I'll show you how we do that. We'll have that together. SSP, and y'all remember. Like, comment, subscribe, and we're going to make 350s great again.